In the mountains of west central Mexico, a native tribe called the Huicol live in a culture that is very similar to that of their ancestors. The Huicol are known worldwide for their art, including their sacred tradition of yarn paintings. A shaman artist will spend many, many hours painstakingly creating a painting that incorporates meaningful symbols from their culture. I'm going to demonstrate a faster, tidier, more direct process to share with students while they learn about the Huicol. No glue required. Begin with a pencil drawing on a sheet of paper. Place it on the reverse side of a piece of adhesive back felt. Trace the drawing using firm, even pressure so the design will be embossed into the backing paper. Now, with the pencil tip and some heavier pressure, I intentionally press through the paper into the felt, cutting away a section of the design. The adhesive is exposed in just one area, so I can work here and keep the rest covered. The next step is to paint with string. I find embroidery floss easiest to use because it sticks well and I can get some great detail with it. Use one hand to move the string and the other to tap it into place. Lay the string side by side, make loops and swirls or zigzags to fill the space. You can use small pieces or frays to create short lines and texture. And if you make a mistake, you can just pull it up again and start over. Once I have an area finished, I'll press it down firmly with my whole hand, then use my pencil to cut another section away to fill. Continue until the entire design is complete. It's a good idea to brush a clear coating over the surface to seal and protect when you're finished. Let's look at some options. First of all, remember it doesn't have to be square. Shapes can be cut from the felt. You can use a needle to add stitching, finish the edges, or attach the piece to a dowel to hang. And before applying the final coating, fill the open areas of adhesive by pressing seed beads, glitter, confetti, or other small materials in place to add texture and interest. To download a PDF with complete instructions, materials, and teaching standards, please visit dickblick.com.